Hello, 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 hello. What up, loopies? What up, internet? Uh, today is May 10th, which is World Lupus Day. If you don't know who I am, my name is Tennille Stewart. I help people who have gone from, or who have been diagnosed with lupus, go from confused and discouraged to healed, hopeful, and in control of the medical narrative. Uh, today is day nine of a lupus lesson minute. Uh, lupus is an autoimmune disease that basically your immune system is confused and attacking healthy cells in your body, uh, skin and um, hair and organs and all kinds of everything. So SLE, uh, systemic lupus erythematosus, is the classic. <laughs> She's that girl that people know about and hear about all the time. Uh, and I am just giving little lessons on little known facts, I guess, about lupus, or if you've never heard of lupus, it's great to go back and watch all of my older videos and see, you know, what's going on. Uh, so May 10th is today, it's the ninth day of me doing this, but um, May 10th is World Lupus Day. Uh, we are still a very little known, uh, hey, Hey, Bayesian Shinobi, Jermaine, what's up? Uh, we are still a very little known disease. So getting awareness out there is very important. That's why I'm doing what I'm doing. Uh, I don't, <clears throat> when I got diagnosed, I was 19. And I had no idea what that was. I had never heard of it. I didn't know anybody with it. Uh, it was confusing to me uh, and scary because it was all about like life expectancy and I was in full body pain and nobody, they said there was no cure, so I just thought, I guess I'm gonna, my life is gonna suck now, I guess. And I'm glad that I found out that is not how it has to happen. So, uh, Lupus, World Lupus Day was created in 2004 in Canada. Uh, Canada, Canada, you got my heart because it's where all the nice people are and like, why did America not think to do this? <laughs> like, hello. Um, <clears throat> so World Lupus Day is sponsored by World Lupus Federation, a coalition of lupus patients organized, organized patient organization from around the world. Um, and I found out today also that lupus was discovered in 18... Like the first, the first uh, case of lupus was presented in 1833. So how is it 1833 lupus exists and uh, 2004 that we have a day of our own? Like, what? Huh? I don't understand. Um, it doesn't really make any sense to me. This whole thing does not make sense to me. So to celebrate lupus, uh, World Lupus Day, wear your purple. Jermaine, I have your purple shirt. I'm sorry. But, uh, <laughs> uh, wear, like, whatever, like, swag you get from the wall. So, whatever lupus foundation things that you've gone to. Um, and research if you're not getting fed this way. Go get on Instagram and look up the word lupus. Look up uh, lupus warrior. Look up any of the hashtags I have in my, uh, in my videos. Or, you know, whatever kind of chronic illness like this whole month is lupus awareness month and we also found out it's so many other people's months also so celiac disease we learned about yesterday um breast cancer breast cancer or just cancer Can skin cancer skin cancer away so i'm i'll talk about the uh one more thing and then my uh thoughts on having days of people's amongst people's uh diseases so julian lennon John Lennon's son. Do you know who John Lennon is? He was the Beatles, famous, local owner. I don't know, John Lennon. Uh, <clears throat> so his son, John, Julian Lennon, uh, is a global ambassador for the Lupus Foundation of America. And uh, he found out uh, he had a childhood friend named Lucy who had lupus also. And there's a song called Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds. I'm so sorry, I don't think I know that song. Uh, was a kindergarten friend of his and that song was written about her and she had lupus and there's a new Lucy that's somebody who knows grandmother and they made a new Lucy song and like 
2013, I think. And, uh, yeah, so he is very invested in lupus, even though he does not personally have it, which I think is amazing. Um, but this whole, the day in general is made to raise awareness, which I totally appreciate and, you know, I'm on board for, like, wear your purple, wear your butterflies. Oh, I, I couldn't find my lupus shirt today, so I'm wearing... Um, my Sweet Tea's Vegan Bakery shirt, which is my bakery. So, y'all, if you want some really awesome vegan treats, if you have a sweet tea, but you, you know, want to be helpful to the planet and stuff harmful, I got you. I'm not sure. So, I'll end up there. I'll tag my, uh, other, my website, my Instagram for my bakery. If you are so inclined to need some sweets, it's a Mother's Day for your mother. She'd probably be like some some brownies, cookies, and cakes, or something like that, so, here I am, um, yes, thank you, um, I'm guessing that is meant to say best, because they are, <laughs> thank you so much, best vegan treats for sure, um, I am torn about all of the walks and things like that, in my most honest opinion, like, I love, I love to support other people who are going through what I have been through or worse or different uh you know suffering is universal pain is universal uh I don't need a language uh to explain like pain I can tell by facial expression or you know like illness is not picky no one would go to a grocery store and pick it up for themselves so if you are if you are with the cause, I'm with the cause. The issue that I have, and Lord, I talked about this on the internet, so be gentle. <laughs> the issue that I have is that people do all these fundraising things and make a million purple or pink or green wristbands and t-shirts and this and that, whatever. All of that money could be going to wars research it could be going towards finding more cures like getting the getting the word out there could be free like look at me talking to you right now this could all be free we are wasting resources precious resources on silly frivolous things that like yes purple makes me happy and it's always made me happy and I've always been a purple girl I've always been a butterfly girl my whole life, uh, I just, I'm not sure that that is important to me about this disease, like, to have these walks and printing a million signs that say, like, this stuff on them that we're going to use for one day and throw away, I, I'm not the biggest fan, I don't get it, so, I love being a curmudgeon, or if that makes sense to anyone else, I just think, get the facts out there, get people interested so that they want to do research. Like, it's a small er in illness, like, people don't know about. But there's a lot of other illnesses that are small er that people don't know about, like, different childhood cancers and that kind of thing. Like, we should just be diligent in doing the work and not so much showing off, kind of. Like, yes. Anyhow. Anyhow. Uh, let me stop this right. So, and that's going to be it for today for the most part. I just wanted to say, uh, celebrate your people with lupus. Go research something today. Besides this video, go research something today about lupus. Go find out if anybody, like, go on social media. Does anybody I know have lupus? Because sometimes there are a lot of people that you know you have no idea. Hey, Darren. Great afternoon, sir. Uh, it is important to feel seen. Uh, it is like a, a human need. So, uh, you should definitely find those people that are in your community and tell them, like, we're not alone. We understand. We are making an effort to be a part of your world because it is isolating to be a sick person when people are able-bodied and they can't even look at you and tell that you're sick. So, you know, I've been, I've been not so good for the past few days, and today is the first day I woke up and I felt good. I did a good workout and 
yeah, my, my day's going really well. And I've still been doing what I had to do for those other days. And nobody would know that it wasn't like a physically amazing day for me. So find your lupus community. Loopies, I'm here with you. Represent three L's up. Uh, everybody post all of the lupus awareness, lupus world, lupus day things on your socials. I'm here. Tag me. I'm going to post a few things today also. I love you guys. Thank you so much for being here. You made it nine days of lupus facts. And uh, we're going to keep going for as much of this month as we can. All right? Have a great day. Bye.